Hello viewers, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. Today we are going to discuss about the hot pressing process for the processing of ceramic matrix composites. So let's get into this video. Hot pressing is a simultaneous application of pressure and high temperature. So this can accelerate the rate of densification and a pore free fine grained compound can be obtained. It involves two stages incorporation of a reinforcing phase into an unconsolidated matrix and matrix consolidation by hot pressing. It is also called as slurry infiltration process. This diagram shows the complete process of the hot pressing. First, the spool consisting of a reinforcement in the form of a filament or a wire is taken then it is followed to a container which contains slurry that is powdered glass in water and resin binder then it it goes forward to the take up drum from which it can be obtained in form of a plate or a sheet then it can be cut into pieces then it can be stacked together then it can burn out in a furnace for the sintering or the consolidation process finally the load is applied heat and pressed in a hydraulic press so that the densification is obtained by this we can easily produce the composite products a fiber toe or a fiber preform is impregnated with a matrix containing slurry by passing it to a slurry tank this slurry consists of the matrix powder a carrier liquid and an organic binder then this organic binder is burned out prior to consolidation wetting agents may be added to ease the infiltration of the fiber tau or preform this impregnated tau or a prepeg is wound on a drum and dried. This is followed by cutting and stacking of the prepegs and consolidation in a hot press. This prepex can be arranged in a variety of stacking sequences. The stacking process is an important process in this type of composite production because the stacking involves the uh, it can enhance the properties of the composite product. If the uh, sheet is uh, stacked in only in one direction such as, such as the zero degree, the strength is only uh, supposed to have in the only one direction. It is not in the other direction that is y direction. If you have placed the stacks stack of piles or composites in both the 0 degree, 90 degree, 45 degree means we can get the multi-directional property and have good strength in all the directions. Then the slurry infiltration process is well suited for glass or glass ceramic matrix composites mainly because the processing temperature of these materials are lower than those used for crystalline matrix materials. Any hot pressing process has certain limitations also because of the complex shapes so here are the process parameters these are to be managed suitably that is precise control with a narrow working temperature range and minimization of the processing time utilization of the pressure low enough to avoid fiber damage here also the fiber damage is the critical part for the composite production because if the fiber is lengthy and strong the final composite product is also in good uh, good strength property if it is damaged the complete product is get wasted or the property losses in the composite product then this is the hot pressing graph temperature is increased to 600 to 700 degrees celsius and further increase with the addition of the pressure it is maintained stable 
and then it is lowered so that we can get these grains so the advantages are low porosity products can be obtained easily and high strength and toughness can be obtained the disadvantages are relatively low melting or softening point of the matrix material because we use the glass as a reinforcement the glass melts um, between 600 to 700 degrees celsius or even lower that so that the final product also melts at low melting point so this is a short video friends if you like this video please click the thumbs up button and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos so thank you for watching